Give me thy torch, Lord. Hence, and stand aloof. Yet put it out, for I will not be seen. Under yon new trees lay thee all along, holding thine ear to the hollow ground. So shall no foe be destroyed. Being loose, unfurled, with digging of a grave. But thou shalt hear, whistle then, whistle then me, and signal that thou hearest something of him. Give me those flowers, do as I bid thee. Go. I am almost, almost afraid to stand alone here in the churchyard, yet I will adventure. Sweet flower, with flowers thy bridal bed I stroke, I stroke. O oh, Lord, thy hand is dust and stones, which with sweet water and the owl drew. Or one in that with tears distilled by home, the obsequies that I for thee will be. Night shall be to true, thy great and What cursed foot wanders this way tonight to cross my obstacles and to the right? What with a torch muffle me night a while? Give me that mat and the wrenching iron. Oh, yeah. Hold, take this letter early in the morning. See you see, see thou deliver it to my Lord and Father. Give me the light. Upon thy life I charge thee. Wait, whether thou hearest or cease stand aloof. And do not interrupt me in my course. Why I descend into the, this bed of death is partly to behold my lady's face, but chiefly to make thanks from her dead finger a precious ring, a ring that I must use in dear employment, therefore and be gone. But if thou, jealous, dost return to pride, in what I farther shall intend to do, my heaven I will tear thee joint by joint and screw this hungry churchyard with thy limbs. The time and my intents are savage, while more fierce and more inexorable far. The empty tires or the roaring sea. So shalt thou show me that friendship, take thou that. Live and be prosperous, and farewell, good fellow. Thou detestable mom, mom, thou womb of death, for with the dearest morsel of the earth, thou thus I enforce thy rotten jaws to open, and in despite I'll cram thee with more food. This is that banished, body haunting you, that my murdered my lord's cousin, with which a dream. It is supposed that the fair future did I, and here's come to do some willingness to shame. To the dead bodies, I'll apprehend it. Stop thy unmodeled talk, vile Montague. Can vengeance be pursued further than death? Condemned villain, I do apprehend thee. Obey and go with me without his I must indeed, and therefore came I hither. Good gentle youth, tempt not a, a desperate man. Why hence, and leave me? I think upon these, God, let them affright me. I beseech thee, you put not another sin upon my head. Be by urging me to fury. Oh, be gone. By heaven, I love thee better than myself. For I come hither armed against myself. Stay not, be gone, live, and hereafter say, Bad man's mercy, bid thee run away. I do defy thy combination, and apprehend thee for a felon here. Will, will thou provoke me? Then have at me, boy. O oh Lord, they fight, I will go call the watch. Read your line.